The quartering pees on his basement floor, August 17th, 2020. I'm assuming this is the one. You never know. You never know. Maybe I'm gonna pee in my trash can down here. I don't know. <laughs> what my an aggressive wife went opening. Out for pizza without me, and I'm angry about it. So I'm gonna win this round, and I'm gonna pee. If I don't win this round, I'm gonna pee in my own basement. What an ultimatum. So fill me in on the, the context here. Why is he mad that his wife went out for pizza? What what exactly happened? It was just because she went without him. Hmm. Okay. I mean, isn't he streaming though? Like, I imagine she went without him because he's streaming. He seems very drunk. I'm assuming he's drunk, right? Okay. Interesting. What do we think about that? I don't have a bathroom down here. Oh, we made it. I was ready to pee my pants. <laughs> I, I, I don't have a toilet down here. All I have is a drain in the floor. Stop threatening us with some great content. Just fucking piss yourself. Let's go. I feel like we're going to have to use it, though. I feel like we're going to have to use it. Why can't he just go upstairs and pee in a toilet? I gotta pee so bad. 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 I'll never survive this round. I'm not gonna survive this round. I gotta pee so bad. <laughs> Woo! Oh, I'm almost about to pee my pants. I gotta pee so bad. I gotta pee so bad. I wanna lose. So I can pee. Just go pee, man. Lose. Is he waiting for the teacher's permission or something? Like, goddamn, man, just, just go relieve yourself. I have to be so bad. I have to be so bad. Man, he must have been beyond hammered. Don't you dare talk about water. Ah. It's only Fall Guys, bro. Come just go on. piss. Yeah, exactly. It's just Fall Guys. I have to be so bad. You guys don't even know. He's kind of dialed in on Fall Guys right now, though. He's cruising. He's almost in the finals. Man's got Jeez, gamer geez. genetics. I, I don't even know what to say. Uh, don't don't talk about water. Don't don't talk about water. Thanks, Arisa Bigby. Don't talk about it. Man, does so does he don't just tease it. for five don't minutes here? It. I made the final round. Somebody owes me 10 subs. All this foreplay. 10 subs. I made it the final round. I have to be so bad, though. It's hard to describe how angry my bladder is. Thanks, Reese Hoff and yes, Popsicle. Yes, I know. It's going to explode. My bladder's going to blow. Oh. Get up! No! Damn, he doesn't just pee at... I couldn't really hear it. It's like I'm listening for like a heartbeat with a stethoscope or something. Yeah, I couldn't hear that for shit. I've literally never lost that round. I've never lost that round. Hmm. I've never lost that round. <laughs> That's a shame. I thought there was going to be like a dark side fill moment where he does it like in full view of the camera. I'm a little underwhelmed. Ugh. You missed the best part? The best part. 
Wouldn't the P be the climax? <sighs> oh my god. I just peed in my basement. <laughs> Realization's hitting. No, not in the K letter. Just uh, in the drain. In the drain. Look, if you want to watch a streamer that wants to pee in the potty, go watch someone else. When you're a pro gamer like me, yeah, I mean, if you're if you're a dude that if you want to watch a dude that's going to piss in the fucking uh, overflow tank in his base basement, that's who I am. You know. What a selling point. I'm not All taking right. a pause to pee. Cool. That was kind of hype. I would have preferred if he peed like at the station so we could watch, but whatever. Maybe next time. Honestly, respect as a gamer. I don't have respect for that until he shit in his pants. There's still that iconic video of that guy who was streaming. I think it was Mafia. And his mom came in talking about how she could smell that he was shitting himself. That's gaming. Don't forget about Oslo. Second place smithing. Yeah, that's, an, that's a RuneScape classic. There is a guy named Oslo who is competing to get like the most smithing XP ever in a day. And in order to do it, he started shitting himself while playing because he couldn't take the time to go take a shit because it'd be XP waste. At least, at least that's how his story goes. And then if I remember correctly, he actually got banned from the game for some like really foul shit that he did. Not like the poopy pants stuff, but like something actually like very bad. What's your take on requiring ID to sign up for websites like Twitch, etc.? Is that an idea they're actually tossing around? Sounds awful to me. Last thing I want to do is have a big fucking headache when trying to sign up for websites. Speaking of ID, what's your opinion on verification for competitive games to reduce trolls? Uh... I don't know if it's a hot take, but I really hate all of the effort that's being made to reduce trolls. All that does is reduce the, like, f fun might not be the right word, but reduce the overall product itself in order to cater to these boogeymen without it ever actually doing anything. I think it's fucking useless. Requiring ID would make fewer bots and scammers. I think it's good. Well, yeah, it seems to be the argument for it. Uh, I disagree, though. I, I'm one of those people that don't, doesn't really like to be giving out all kinds of personal info when signing up to a goddamn fucking social media site. Plus, regardless of uh, what measures they put in place, there's always going to be bots and trolls. It's never going to stop it. And data breaches putting your info out. True, data breaches, especially with that kind of shit on there, is such a big deal. And data breaches happen pretty often now. I feel like it's once every year there's like a big data breach. Sad to hear defeatism whenever this is being discussed. What are you talking about? Like uh, anti-bot and troll measures? It's not really defeatism, man. It's changing the entire product to make it more intrusive and more of a headache and a lot more intense for every user under the idea that it's somehow going to stop bots and trolls. If you want a solution that's all around better, just hire more people that work in that department that punish bots and trolls instead of take it or instead of put the onus on the users to submit ID and shit. It's not really defeatism. It just makes it much more intrusive and a lot more of a hassle for every user that's not a bot and troll. Just invest more resources into punishing bots and trolls.